But yeah, I was just kind of nattering in a circle there. But yeah, I'm very looking forward to Classic and Slave Master Blackheart. Um, and I'll be showing you, I'll be thorough in my playthrough of it, showing you all, all the quests I can, and I'll be doing dungeons and raids and everything. I'm not too sure but on the alliance side. Hmm, that was odd. Uh, you know, in regards to their stuff, but I would be very interested in do you know seeing their sides of stuff. Of course, that being said, I'm not. Too... No, actually, there will be some alliance raids and like raid quests and whatnot. They'll have their own iteration of stuff. Oh, I could just kill these outright. I was only a dwarf. So yeah, you don't actually need to even try to free these people. But, um... Oops. But yeah, um... Um... Yeah, I think I prefer... This type of... Never. I love working for the Dark Iron. Sure you do. But, uh, yeah, I think for the Demology Warlock, it feels much more natural to me. But, um... About time, I'm sick of being a slave. <laughs> That's always hysterical to me. And you're terrible at your job. Uh, the union's gonna hear about this. This is your last time, Dave. This is your last fuck up. Yes, Dave the Dark Iron Slaver. But yeah, Dark Iron Scraps used to be a thing, and and when I get around, well, like they used to be like an important trade-in kind of thing. When um, I get around to here in cl in my classic playthrough, you'll get to see what I'm talking about. They were important for the faction turning. I keep feeling like I'm not forgetting to say something there again. Um, three, I'm tempted in doing three characters. On uh, Torn Warrior, though that could change. A warrior of some sort, I'm thinking, will be best. Warrior, Undead Warlock, and some alliance character. Thinking those three. We'll be tempted in showing Paladin. What they were like back then, but then I wouldn't be able to do any content uh, without having to play healer, which meaning no content. So I'm thinking I'll probably, you know, stick to a, a more established ca class and uh, classic. Um, then I was saying about, you know, how different Warlocks are now to when, the way they were back then, uh, back in when I started, and I was hoping that classic Warlocks would be more familiar to me, you know? Obviously they will be different still, but less different, you know? So... Warrior, Undead Warlock, yeah, I think I've hit all the notes. I just still feel like I'm half forgetting to finish something or say something. It's weird to see a Null talk like that. You know? Seems too intelligent for them.
Alright. Voidwalker hit it. Uh, you know, hit the rescued slave. Could just kill these, but... Eh, I'm playing nice. Would be funny if he was like, Are you here to save me? And he'd be like, No! I don't want to be saved! Oh, nice. These fed this, and then that fed th these. He went down easy. All the um, classic zones are gonna go a lot slower. A lot slower. Like, um, I wouldn't have a mount right now. Actually, no, I would have a mount, but I've only gotten it level 40. And I think it is more expensive. And certainly the epic mounts are, you get them at level 60 and they are really expensive. Playing as a Paladin or a Warlock will get you a class quest. Remember, people apparently bitch a ton about them getting free mounts, but they can be actually rather expensive. For Paladins, I know you have to do a huge quest where you have to get like an Azerothian diamond and different material uh, to get your mount. You kind of homage it in the um, Legion quest to get your class mount there. Cow King's Hide. Huh, cool. But, uh, you know, they kind of homage it in, um, in Legion, but it was obviously much more arduous back in the base game. And Warlocks get their own version. And also, there are such a thing as class quests back then as well. Like, you, oh, like as a paladin, I remember, you hit level tw ten, 20, you're, you get a quest to go to Shadowfang Keep to reclaim some ingots to make a new weapon for you. I never did the quest, sadly. And eventually got removed from the game. Remember over at the dig site over here? Uh, you will get a, in Classic, there was, like, pre kata There was a quest you could get there. And I do believe it would actually eat here. Dying Archaeologist, Booty Bay. But, uh, it's odd that he's flagged for Booty Bay, but sure. Um, I do believe it would actually eat you here. Yeah, actually, I think this is actually the very place. And I think actually... I think this could actually even be the very guy. Basically, you'll find a guy in an outhouse, and you do a few quests for him, and one thing will lead to another, and then he'll try to kill you down here. So, um, yeah. Again, you'll see all this when I finally get around to it on Classic. Uh, the altar seems to beckon to you, as if it were alive. Touch the Santara stone. So, how do you know what type of stone it is? Well, did uh, Chandelin take a geology course while I was not playing her? Certainly probably had enough time. And call forth L uh, Latoric the Black and his guardian, Sidonian. It's obsidian, but with an O at the end. Obsidian? Obsidian. Are you here to stop the Archduke? Your flag for Booty Bay as well? Rise, Obsidian! Rise and destroy the interlopers!
seeing a lot of immunes pop up. A bit annoying. This is actually kind of nice because you can sac like rather than waiting for the hounds to die to give you the uh, the demonic core, you can just do it when you want. But it's reliant on you having imps and then thirty second cooldown of sacrifice. Not using foul guards, so it's not too useful to me. Yeah, we'll keep using what we're using. There we go. Ah, didn't even see it. Um, also, one thing, there will not will not be an auto sort in um, the uh, base in the base game, as uh, yeah in the classic servers. There might be an item though that uh, a mod though that gives you one. I will probably play the game slightly modded, not as much as some people do it, but slightly. Torian Brotherhood lookouts and you. You know, they're being surprisingly casual despite the fact that there's three enemy soldiers and an enemy officer just standing around in their, uh, you know, place. You know, like the mooks down here. We, ch we chose to leave the protection comfort of the depths to exploit her. I mean, yes, that's right. Explore the world. Y you've done very good. I don't like slavery slavery either. Uh huh, like the other guy. Strange how many slaves uh, call poorly freedom. Shame to, uh, to have to do what we do, but such are the truths of war. Now we must move on to more pressing tasks. Well, f uh, well if I will for Chandelier, I'm beginning to feel the time turn. Now, when you're ready, let's hit these dark irons where it really hurts. Oh, nice. Still. I have an heirloom, uh, heirloom weapon. I'm sticking with it. It's a little known fact that dwarves, particularly of the dark iron variety, need rest. Lots of rest. Now I ask you, how can they sleep without pillows? Exactly, Chandelin, they can't. That's why you must steal their pillows. Once you finish your cushion thievery, t uh, talk with Taskmaster Scrange. He's a, b a bit deeper in the cave, working on a covert pro project with Hansel. Really? I'm stealing some pillows. Kill him with sleep deprivation. Like, seriously, it is actually a good tactic. Well, like, deny your enemy sleep, but... Depending on what they're sleeping on, I've... You know, you, you can sleep without a pillow. I know I did that a few times. Don't remember why. But, you know, like, my mattress was, you know, nice and soft, you know? I, I, it was years back, I honestly don't remember. Remember something happening to my pillow once, and uh, you know, it was, you know, it was only good for to be binned afterwards. Maybe it was because of that. I'm not sure, but um, yeah, you know, if they've got a mattress, it's not too bad. Somehow, probably not. Dark blacksmith. Okay. That, that, they don't look too bad. They don't look too bad. <sighs> I 
And they, they just want to die. Oh, budge. So much mage weave. Well, so I okay, just so, was saying I won't be using it. I may hold on to it. Also, I swear they use the uh, white letter icon there. Yep, they did. These are spawning in as I'm here. But yeah, I won't be leveling my professions. I probably will just auction it. You know, if other people want to piss away money, that's fine with me. Again, I don't like the change of having everything separate. I can kind of understand why they did it, but I don't like how everyone's just segmented off now. The sleepy Dark Iron Worker. Our pillars! Someone has stolen our pillars! Okay, they aren't that dangerous. And the Golan! <laughs> God damn, the Agro Ranger. They're very protective of their pillars. Bell's here! Yeah. But, um. Yeah, I, I, I just feel that, you know. There's even, there's just no, like, unless there's something special there, there's no point in leveling, you know, you know, some tiers of the profession now. And I feel that's just taking away value of the game that's there, you know, it's reducing the game down even further. Well, I can just kind of understand why they did it, because, you know, you switch professions in an expansion, of or for the new expansion, and... You now have to level it up from the get go, uh, from the base up, and that will take a while and a lot of money, and or just a lot of time, you know, grinding up the materials. But uh, you know, in dealing with that, they've made that old stuff. You know, like why would you ever touch it? You know, and I'm not a fan of that either. I liked that old content, and I liked doing it that way. You know, I just felt fun to me. You know. But I suppose I'm just an odd fish. Speaking of odd fishes, uh, I can't. I can't remember what this, the movie was called. Fish tail. Fish life. I'm not sure. But basically, it's like some kids are at this like lighthouse or something, and they like drink this potion that turns them into a fish. Uh, the reason I'm bringing it up is I just someone was sharing it a while back. Christ, you're huge for a dwarf. But um. The you know final scene with the bad guy from it, they are sharing that and talking about it. Uh, Won't spoil things. I remember loving that movie as a kid. But uh, throwing thing. Um, not CGI or and weird. It was just you know, drawn Western animation thing. Um, I just remember really enjoying it. So, what pillows? What? Let's see, I've always is up to old tricks again. I guess I'll just uh, hang on to these pillows for a while. The most, the important part is that you're here. We're going to need your help. I feel this will, that make more sense if you've done the classic version of this, these quests, which I have, but I don't remember. Guess we'll see when the classic comes around. Of course, again, classics something ye have, but I'm currently recording this on the 24th of something. 24th of May, 2019. I think it's coming out in August? I think that's when it's coming out. So, they announced it a while back, but I can't remember. I think it's August, so... Yeah, I'm talking about this a bit in advance.
Oh, I, I can't remember what I was saying. Let's stop and check. 